Hello. My surgery is not for a few hours, and do you think I could sleep? Of course not, and you know that I can't eat either, so I was thinking, how am I going to fill up the time? It's a no-brainer, I'm going to make a video, and I wanted to share with you this Y-Spell tarot kit, because this is one of the most incredible values I have run into, and if you have been thinking about getting a tarot deck, but you're a person that wants to have a nice setup before you even start, well, this, I think, would be an excellent choice. So it's one of these cool magnetic boxes. I did my best to pack things back in, but, you know, I'm not very good at that. On the top, we have the Tarot Journal. And it is a nice one because it's got suggestions of spreads and then ways that you can explore. So you can see, did I make the right decision? We just had one about career. Here is the two choices spread. It's a very nice journal. I like when there are ideas for different kinds of spreads. This is Journey in the World, Daily Sun Rituals. So there's the tarot journal. Here is the guidebook that, of course, gives you the definitions for the cards. But these aren't just normal definitions. So it talks about the colors that are in the card and the symbolism of not only the colors, but the symbolism in the art on the card, which is the traditional rider weight. And then it also has the keywords, the upright and reversed meanings, and it's just a very nice guidebook, I believe. Nice and thick. Now, I'm going to keep going, but I think I need to take this out next. So let me get this out of the way. Here is a nice tarot cloth, and look how big it is. I mean, you can't really tell how big it is, but it's big. And... I have it the wrong direction, I can see, because now I notice that it's got the, the Three of Swords and the Ace of Pentacles here and the Ace of Wands and the Two of Cups. So it's definitely a tarot cloth. We'll just put this back out here. Now this is probably my favorite thing here because this is a card holder. And in this middle section, it's just the right size for a candle. If you like a little ambiance, you could put a stone in there too. Now, you have the bag for your cards. And here are the cards. The fancy stuff on the sides. Shiny metallics on the backs. And this is the deck. Hopefully it's not got any nudity that's going to spring up here and take me by surprise. So again, this is a traditional Rider weight, But the, the colors, I think, are a little more brilliant. Anyway, this company does produce a lot of value. You get a lot of bang for your buck. They have a beginner deck, too. You know, like the ones that have the keywords right on them, upright and reversed. But look at that. Isn't that a hell of a deal? A deck that you could easily pay twenty four ninety nine for. The bag to keep the cards in. The cloth to pull the cards on. The card holder, which I should have shown you, and why not have the Ten of Cups and the Ace of Pentacles. And then, of course, the guidebook, if you don't already know all the cards by heart, and the tarot journal. Again, the Amazon affiliate link is on my website, on the My Amazon Links page, and the website is thequirkyhealer.com. Thanks for watching. Bye.